Hi, welcome back again to my channel and for today's video, we will talk about a topology on the Cartesian product of topological spaces. <music> Before we'll start with our discussion for this, let us recall first, say you have x, b, a set. Of course, this one here denotes the power set of x. And then we let, let's say script b, be a subset of the power set of x, such that yung mga conditions niya nag-hold. Number one is the empty is in b. Number two, the union of B such that B is in script B is equal to X. And then number three, if your B1 and B2 are in B, yeah, in script B, then there exists a set, let's say B, um, paano ba? let's say bar na lang subset of script B such that the union of B which is in script B this one is equal to B1 intersection B2 so ang implication lang naman ito is may mahanap ka kunyari this is your script B ang mangyayari you will have a subset which is script B bar such that lahat ng mga elements niya Let's say, if you take the union for that, that's the same as the intersection of B1 and B2. So basically, parang napapaloob sila. So if this happens so, ibig sabihin na, if we have the set U of subscript B, which is equal to the set of U in the power set of X, such that U is the union of elements in B, then this one is a topology. On X. And this one here, the script B, is the basis for it. Okay. So now that we have discussed what a script B standing for, so we will now introduce this theorem for our discussion. So you have pair X tau sub X and Y tau sub Y be topological spaces. And we let B be the collection of subsets of X cross Y of the form A cross B where your A is coming from tau sub X and your B is coming from tau sub Y. Okay, so ano yung implication nito? Then B, script B is a basis for a topology on X cross Y and the topology generated by script B is called what? Is what we call the product topology. Okay, so how do we do that? How can be so sure this is true? Remember, di ba yung MT natin can be written as MT cross MT? Nag-drop lang ako ha. Okay, so ibig sabihin ni, this is MT cross MT. And so this is element of script B. Tama ba? Kasi di ba sabi natin, B be the collection of subsets of the form, this one. I mean, of these subsets of these of the form A cross B. So alam naman natin na yung MT galing sa tau sub X. Yung isang empty galing sa tau sub y. So therefore, if we can take the cross here, we get that these are elements of script B. Sige, let's try. Let x sub 0, y sub 0, element of x cross y. Sige, anong ibig sabihin nito? Di ba your x cross y is in B? Kasi sabi nito, ya yeah, collections of subsets. Okay? So ibig sabihin, yung second condition natin na ganito, is trivial holding. The second condition trivially holds. Yan. Okay, so how can we move further? Let, let's say, A1 and A2 be open sets in X. Tapos, and kuha tayo ng B1 and B2 be open sets in Y. So, anong implication nito? So, I have I have a1 cross B1 intersection A2 cross B2. So, di, di ba this is the same as A1 cross, I'm sorry, A1 intersection A2 cross 
B1 intersection B2. So alam naman natin these are elements elements ni x and then elements ni y. So mangyayari dito this is element of the script B. So therefore the script B is a basis for x cross y. So that's it. So if you have any question or clarification please let me know. So ibig sabihin the definition here, I mean the theorem here, the topology generated by script B is called the product topology. That's it. Okay, so let's have this theorem here. So if you have script B, which is a basis for the topology on X and the script C is a basis for the topology on Y, then you, if you have the script D, which is a collection of B and B cross C where your B is coming from script B and C be coming from script C, then this D, script D rather, is a basis for the product topology. And the product topology that is referred here is the X cross Y. Okay, so how do we prove this? If this is true. Any questions or clarification, please. Okay, so let, let's say we try, let W be an open set in X cross Y. Okay. So, yung goal natin dito, our W is a union of elements in script D. Tama? Kasi di ba para magiging basis siya, um, that means lahat ng mga elements on that set that we are aiming to prove that that is actually the basis, lahat ng union niya is actually a representation or as an element of the topology. Okay. So, mangyayari doon that our goal here, W, can be expressed as a union of elements in D. So, of course, my case is tayo. Case 1, if W is empty, then we are done. Tama? Kasi the empty can be expressed as a union of empties. Case 2, so we let, let's say, P equals X, Y, Tapos yung x, y mo is an element of w. Okay. So this is an open set. So ang goal natin dito, so it suffices to show that, paano ba? It suffices to show that there exists, tama ba? Let's say b sub p and script b and c sub p in script c such that yung P mo is an element of that representative. Tama. Kasi kailangan mo lang naman kumuha ng po, um, point on the W such that meron ka mahanap na open ball or open set B and open set C um, coming from respectively B, script B or script C such that yung product nila contains the P. And that product is actually in W. So since W is open, di ba sabi natin W is open in uh, X cross Y? Anong implication nito? So dahil open siya, there exist open sets U and let's say A and B. Let's say, paano ba? Ang hindi pa natin nagamit na symbol. Ganyan na lang. Oh, A tilde, B tilde in uh, X and y respectively such that yung p mo which is x y is an element of a tilde cross b tilde di ba ganito yon and alam natin ang a tilde at uh, b cro uh, tilde cross niya is a subset of w so how about if we fix that so pag if we fix ba natin so let's say we fix a Tel D and B tel D. Yan. So since you, since A tel D is open, alam natin yan, and B tel D is open, since A tel D is open in X, so ibig sabihin nun, there exists, let's say, A prime, tama ba? So A prime, 
in A tilde such that yung X natin is coming from script B. So, anong implication din sa isa? Since B is open, B tilde is open, in X, ibig sabihin nun, there exists, I'm oh, sorry, correct me, correct me, correct me, Um, that's not X, it should be Y. So, there exists, let's say, B prime, uh, and B tilde, such that your Y is an element of Paano ba to? C, which is a subset of B tilde. So, tilde na lang para hindi na mawala. So, let's say, element of B tilde. Yan. So, there exists B in script B and C in script C such that yung P, uh, yung P mo is an element of B cross C and which is, di ba alam natin, this is a subset of A tilde cross B tilde. And so, this is a subset of W. Hence, the claim is proven. So, if you have any question or clarification, please let me know. So, ibig sabihin, di ba yung collections of open intervals containing the MT and the R constitute a basis for the usual topology on R? So, ibig sabihin nun, a basis... For the Cartesian topology on R cross R, so ito pala, yung R cross R, yung basis niya nag-consist ng MT, R cross R, and the open squares, yung subset of the form I1 cross I2, where your I1 and I2 are open intervals in, I, in R. That's it. Okay, so after that, we will have a definition here. So let's say, let's have a function pi sub 1 represented by x cross y sending to some elements in x and pi sub 2, the same, that's um x cross y pero dun sa y. So these are functions defined respectively as eto, yung re definition ng pi sub 1 and then this is pi sub 2. So, ibig sabihin yung output niya is x. So, pi sub 1. Yung output naman sa, pangal sa pi sub 2 is y. So, these functions are called projections of x cross y onto its first and second component respectively. So, ibig sabihin may pagka onto yan. Okay. So, let's consider a theorem here. The collection, let's say p... Uh, which contains the pi sub 1 inverse of u, your u, such that your u is open in x. And then this is the union of set pi sub 2 inverse b, such that b is open in y. So, ibig sabihin nito, then, is a sub-basis for the product topology on x cross y. Okay. So, how do we show this is true? Sige nga, if u is open in x, so anong implication nito? Then, ang mangyayari dyan, um, your pi 1 inverse of u, that's equal to the set of x, y in x cross y, and such that u sub 1 of, ah, sorry, pi sub 1 of x, y is an element of u. So, ang mangyayari, this is the same as u cross y. Tama ba? So, bali, lahat ng elements ni x, y that is map, uh, that is map to u. So, ito yung lalabas. Okay. So, likewise, ano mangyayari? If b is open in, let's say, y tayo, kasi y naman. So, ibig sabihin nun, your pi sub 2 inverse of V is equal to ganito. Ganito pa rin naman is an element of V. So, this is the same as X cross V. Okay. So, anong ibig sabihin nito pag ganito? So, let's try. Let, let's say, tau be the product topology on X cross Y. And let's say tau prime be the topology 
on x cross y generated by saan siya generate Wala tayong symbol na. Let's say s. So, observe that. Di ba every elements of s belongs to tau? Tama ba? Kasi di ba this is uh, nag-generate siya. So, ibig sabihin, this is the basis. So, this implies that tau prime is a subset of tau. Also, um, a basis for tau is of the form. Di ba ano yung form niya? U cross B. So your U is open in X. And then V is open in Y. And di ba yung U cross V natin is equal to pi sub 1 inverse of U intersection pi sub 2 inverse of V. So anong im ibig sabihin nito? A basis for, a basis element siya of tau is in tau prime. So, ibig sabihin, as a conclusion, that tau is equal to the tau prime. So, which is actually the message here for our theorem. So, if you have any question, guys, or clarification, please let me know. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching if you have any questions or clarification please let me know so that we can discuss on that and for those who are new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe so that you'll be updated on a lot of videos that i'll be uploading soon thank you and have a great day